What's up, everybody? Honest Trailers, the only people actually still actively making trailers these days for people like myself, reactors, to make videos about. And this time it's about one of my favorite movies, actually, The Fifth Element. Uh, I love this movie. Uh, some people might, might consider it a guilty pleasure. I do not subscribe to that uh, term at all. I love what I love, and I don't let other people... Uh, Give me crap for it. I love honest. Uh, I love uh, the Fifth Element. Mila Jovovich, uh, Bruce Willis, obviously, Chris Tucker. I think that's is it. Chris Tucker or Chris Rock? I I can't. Remember. One of the Chris's. I'm sorry. I, it's stupid of me to, to even uh, forget these two guys. But whatever. Uh, I'm boring, you guys, aren't I? I love this movie, and let's see what this movie. What the people of Honest Trailers think about this movie that I love. Did I mention I love this movie? Whatever. This summer, we're getting honest about summer blockbusters, past and present. This is Honest Trailers, Blockbuster Summer. Are you ready for some big budget sci-fi with huge explosions? Crazy shootouts. And killer aliens. One '90s film had the courage to give you all that, plus be really horny. Thank you so much. Really super horny. I'd like to take a few pictures. The archives. <laughs> the Fifth Element. Welcome to the future of America, a land full of smoking, toplessness, and rude waiters. To the point where you just know this movie was made by a bunch of French dudes. Oh, <laughs> beyond entendu. A huge ball of evil is on its way, and the only way to stop it is to gather the power stones of earth, air, fire, and water to summon Captain Planet. <laughs> the power awesome. is yours. I mean, this girl. That whole thing's your name, huh? Meet Lilu, a living weapon who has to be turned on before she turns on. <laughs> and the best man for that job is Corbin Dallas, the ultimate balance of Bruce Willis giving a <laughs> and Bruce Willis not giving a <laughs> about the movie he's currently in. Sir, are you classified as human? Uh, negative. I am a meat popsicle. She might be the supreme <laughs> being, but this right here, it's perfect Bruce. Anybody else want to negotiate? Welcome back to the party, pal. Love you, Frosted Tips, by the way. But they're not the only guardians of this galaxy. Thrill at ancient aliens with the land speed of a box turtle. Please hurry, you still have time. Jedi school dropouts who won't hesitate <laughs> to knock you out and steal your identity. Mr. Dallas? Uh, yeah. A xenomorph who went to Juilliard. <laughs> And a government that is clearly no holds barred. But at the head of the parade is Ruby Rod, a literal dickhead, who, <laughs> love him or hate him, predicted live streaming and podcasts, and will go down in history as the best screamer in sci-fi. <laughs> and also one of the only people to go down in sci-fi. I don't want one position, I want all positions! <gasps> Personally, I think Chris Tucker killed it, but this is the role that Prince was born to play. Kinda. The clock is ticking, and that giant evil space net is on a collision course with Earth, heralding its arrival with the power of Eves. And this testicle has help on the inside. John Batiste Emmanuel Zorg. He's a bad guy with the power of capitalism. They wondered if it would be possible to fire 500,000. Fire one million. A gun that shoots all the things. And the yelling range of a fired up Gary Oldman. Zero stones, <laughs> zero crates! Man, I can't wait to see him fight Bruce Willis in a climactic battle. Wait, did the hero and villain never even meet each other in this movie? What? No? Is that even allowed to happen? 
also if you're a fan of Star Wars Classic Heroes Journey, where a young man destined for greatness answers the call to action and accepts his fate to defeat an empire. Strap in as Fifth Element takes you on the hero's midlife crisis, where a middle-aged man who hates his job answers the call to go on a cruise and accepts his fate to hook up with a lady half his age who doesn't speak English. Lilu Dallas Multipass. In, depending on who you ask, either one of the best or the worst sci-fi films of the 90s, but is indisputably one of the weirdest and is the most fun of Luc Besson's childlike traumatized but badass lady sex object series. Huh. But no matter how you feel about it, one thing is for certain, you'll never forget what the movie is called. Fifth Element. The Fifth Element. Fifth Element. The Fifth Element. The fifth Element. element. Story. Buzz Lightbeer. <laughs> what if God was one of us? Chris Tucked. Darth Bezos. Hold Bezos. me closer, tiny Lister. Freeze him. Blue Yonsei. Blue Yonsei. The Blue Beehive. Lessons about consent. You're right, you're right. I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that. The present day NYPD. <laughs> And this mugger who wears a picture of Corbin's hallway on his head to trick him. No joke here, we just really like the guy. I hope that dance catches on. Blade Runner. Blade Runner. The ZF-1's got nothing on the greatest 90s toy of all time, the Eliminator TS-7. I bring you seven awesome solving weapons all in one. The Power Dagger. Rocket Launcher. The Power Sword. Arrow Launcher. The Laser Sword. Net launcher, the army machine gun, flamethrower, the bayonet machine gun, ice cube system, the cyber gun. Alone, they're incredible. Together, they're unstoppable. Hell yeah! Okay. Hey, Screen Junkies, want more Fifth Element? Then click left for 100 more things we love about this weird movie. And click right to hang out with Screen Junkies Universe, our daily morning show. Thank you for bringing back Blockbuster Summer. Let your conscience be your guide. <laughs> Black <laughs> lives matter. Black lives do matter. Anywho, this was fun. I really enjoyed it. I loved it. And kind of made you want to see this movie. Uh, to be quite honest. Which is exactly what a good, honest trailer should do. And I really enjoyed it. It was Chris Tucker. Again, I apologize for... Uh, getting confused between the two, but I think I actually said Chris Tucker first, so it doesn't count. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. What do you guys think about this uh, Honest Trader here? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Did you, do you like the movie at all? Do you hate the movie? Let me know in the comments below, and until next time, guys, remember, Multipass! Hello again, everybody. I really hope you enjoyed this video, because I really enjoyed making it. So, if you like what you've seen here, please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe for more awesome content like this. So, until next time guys, I'll see you guys next time.